Okay, so frequency is equal to one over two pi times square root g over l. So therefore, frequency is independent of mass because it, in the equation there's um, nothing to do with the mass in the equation. Okay, so which means that uh, the frequency will be the same no matter how heavy is the object at the end of the string. Okay, and the assumption we have made is that the length of a the length of a swing hasn't changed in both the cases. Okay, which means that the length of the swing is constant. In other words. So basically, we assume that the center of the mass for the system hasn't changed, and its position remains at the end of the string. Okay, and this is my explanation and answer for this question.